um what the fuck is up youtube also it's very 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 hot where i am today and of course my mom doesn't turn on the air and i gotta close all the windows to film so if i'm sweaty that's why i'm trying to not wear a whole lot of clothes but um look at my hair i just got my hair done and it's because it's so like humid outside it looks a little frizzy but the color i'm just fucking obsessed with anyways you're not here to listen to all that so Hey besties, get into it yet? Mm -mm. We need to watch some videos that I've been holding back on for a while because I've been busy and living with other people. So I've been putting it off, but now is the time and we are gonna start with Golden Child's uh, Ra Pom Pom. Ra Pom Pom. I knew there was a comeback happening. I don't know what this sounds like, so I'm excited and I'm just gonna zip my lips and get ready to do it. Yeah, yeah, all the curl is gone. <laughs> That's funny. Golden child. I don't know. I don't know whether to say it more like a Korean, like la pom pom, or um, like an American say ra pom pom. Anyways, we're gonna watch it in three, two, one, go. Oh. Outer space. Oh, explosions. Ooh. Ooh, is this connected to burn it? Oh, shit. Oh, I like this already. Oh my god. Oh! Okay. Red haired Zingman? Oh, okay, Dongyan. I love his voice. Oh, look at that glitter on his eyelids. So, like, apocalyptic aliens. Bowman? Rapping? Okay, tag looks so fine. Ah, Jung Jun Jun. Okay. Oh. 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 Hey. Ooh. Making their own drone. Oh shit. Oh my god. Oh my god. He. Why, please? Oh, hey, 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 hey. Okay, wow. Oh, hey, hey, hey. Okay, oh man, Taeyeol. Excuse me, Taeyeol. What the fuck are they looking so fine for? I'm. Oh my god. I'm so glad that they fixed Jaehan's chunky highlights. Oh, yes. Okay. Okay, so they're out there trying to... Wow, that outfit on Teo. This dance is so good, too. Oh shit. Oh! Oh! They hit his leg and his air tank? We gotta go get him. Oh. Oh my god. Why do they always do these plots where they're dying? I can't handle this. Also, oh my god. I, why can't I not tell who's out there? Oh my god! What the fuck is going on here? They are no! Listen to his vocals right here. Oh, that, this thing, I love that. Yeah, yeah. Oh, this all, this all white look. On why? You better be kidding me. Oh, is why? Is he dead? I gotta say this. <laughs> Jesus. This song is a little bit light for this heavy ass theme. No, <laughs> bro, this is so sad. They 
like, thank you for your service and your sacrifice. Bro, that's fucked up. That's fucked up! It's so sad! Oh, oh, he's alive! Ulim, I have a question. What the fuck was that? So, I know that I kind of like started saying a whole bunch of things and then like didn't complete saying anything. I like this song. Is it my favorite of all of the Gold Cha songs? No, but I think it's good. It's catchy. It shows off, excuse me, I'm burping. It shows off some different members that I feel like we don't get as much of. I feel like this really highlighted Taeyo's vocals as well as Bowman rapping, because I feel like Bowman doesn't get a whole lot of lines as far as I can tell, um, because he's not like a main or lead rapper or vocalist, like more like sub vocals. So that was exciting. Also, we kind of got like Tag like singing his rap, which was, ah, delicious. I love, okay, I'm like a Jung Joon girl, but also Tag has really been coming at me. The last couple of comebacks, like, Excuse me? No, 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 you know what? I It doesn't matter what order I go in. Um, I don't have an order. Since when have I been an ordered woman? Um, I love the dance. Um, there are a lot of like Latin inspired moves. Don't perceive my arms, don't do it. Again, I, I'd have to watch for certain moves, but there was something that Juchan, like they were doing and the close up was on Juchan and he did like a something and then a something like this. Like, I don't know. Love that. Their dancing is just so good and they're so in sync with each other. And I love when they started out the beginning and they're all like facing the back and there's like one person moving through and they all kind of move with it or stick out their arms or something. I, I love dances like that. Just adore. I really pretend, why always looks hot? Like it, it, there's, there's no denying it. That man is just so sexy. I love the hair they have on him right now. I think the sort of, I don't even know if I'd call it ashy blonde, but it's more like, I guess it is an ashy blonde on um, Chu Chan. I love it. The red on Sungmin looks really nice. The bl like caramel blondie looking color on Taeyar. He looks fine as fuck. I'm not a Taeyar girl, but like, wow, sir, excuse me. The black hair on Tag with that little dangly earring. God damn it. Oh my God. In terms of outfits, that white one on Y where he's got like the cutoff and the like the high waist of white pants. Absolute death. Just just so good. But I, what I should talk about here is this, they do such elaborate plots or they, I wouldn't, okay, rewind. The last couple of Gorcha videos, like starting with Anandrike or um, like Burn It, they did the whole zombie plot line. And I thought this was going to be connected to that at the beginning, but I think it's something different of like, post-apocalyptic corruption and like you know them being like oh my god we gotta seek shelter we gotta see what's out there and then they see what's out there and there's like military out there trying to keep them in and then shoot at them and then potentially kill Taeyar when Taeyar and Y go out to like save everybody and I wonder if that's just like who they chose for the video or it's because they're the two oldest that's right right I know Taeyar's the oldest and I know he's the leader but I feel like Y is the second oldest because I think he's my age Hey, why? <laughs> hey, Sung Yoon. Like, so fine. He's so fine. Anyways, but they have these elaborate plots. And the one thing that I think I wish that they had done with, with Rap Pom Pom is I wish they made it a little bit longer and given us some like story breaks like they did in Anajuke, which was like a seven minute, eight minute music video. And then given us some time to like bite into the plot because it was going really fast because I know they were trying to keep up with solo shots and dance shots and the the atmospheric plot shots to like shove it all into like a four and a half no four minute oh my god no wonder it felt so fast a four minute music video with all that stuff in it um so i wish they had expanded it a little bit because i think there was some interesting things to get into there they really bring the drama with these like escape routes and like like evacuation drama they're running they're getting shot at or they're being chased by zombies so it was high intensity and i was enjoying it and I think I'm gonna stop talking on that because I have a lot more videos to watch in one sitting. But this was lovely. I am very excited to go through and listen to the whole second album because out of the Gorcha like discography, I wouldn't say that I'm like a su super well versed in the whole thing, but so far my favorite album overall has been their first full album um, that has like the wannabe album. I think it was actually, okay. Strike that, reverse. It might have been a repackage of that. I don't know, I'll find that out. I know what the cover looks like in my head. No, you know what, I'll just look it up right now. It is the first album, the reboot one. Wannabe is a classic, 
but I love Nukyojo lately. I guess I should say that like my three favorite songs. It's not that I dislike the others. I don't know the others as well, but Wannabe and Nukyojo and but like specifically, specifically, they only have the English name up here. I want the Korean name. I also really love um, Juchan's solo, like a song for me or Moonjaya. Beautiful, made me cry. Um, she's my girl. Oh my God, I forgot about that one. She's my girl. But actually my favorite, favorite song on that reboot album is um, Domong Chijima, which I don't think has gotten any attention, but oh my God, is that a banger. I turn that on in the car like at least a couple times a week. Do 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 like yeah, so good. Anyways, that's an old album, but because I liked that full one so much, I'm really excited for the second one because in a full album they get like the space to like have different solo songs or like combination songs and just like put more things on there. So I always feel like there's more potential for full albums to be like some of my favorites because there's just more variety within there than a mini album. But I'm done talking on Golcha for now, but please leave me comments on plot points or like storyline things that I missed. Golden Nesses, I know you out there. Or Golden, Golden Ness? Golden Nesses? I don't know. Tell me in the comments who you think the hottest was, cause you know, a girl is weak for a lot of them. But thank you for watching. I hope you have a great day. Stay cool if you're somewhere hot. Stay warm if you're somewhere cold. And drink some water and I'll see you next time. Bye! Shh.